Welcome to Genesis TV. I'm David Evans and I'm at the Senior Five Aside Football Tournament. Come How do you feel like game one? Uh, I think the team's lacking in fitness to be honest. The pitch is a bit big and for four men running it's it's not going well. I tried to make an early substitution bringing Mikey right on but Rory with a dodgy ankle has went off before me. Uh, I think Mikey Wright deserves player of the tournament already. <laughs> Nuts and boys, early chances, he made the difference. I don't think we could have drew that match without him. Mikey Wright has been sensational in this tournament. How hard is it to defend him? He's just a bill. He's got no coordination, but he just runs at you and it's in your face all the time. Uh, I believe he had a big peg for your legs. Uh, he, he, he left me for dead in the first match. Coach for the Whitehead Rangers. Uh, glad right. to have you down here today. Uh -huh. Are you enjoying yourself so oh, far? Oh yes, we're having a great time. Well run event. And the boys are enjoying it, yep. How many matches have you played so far? Uh, the B team's played one match and the A team's played two. Have you won any of those matches? Uh, the, the, the B team's actually too bad than the A team. Yeah. <laughs> you know? So that is these That's days. the way it works, eh? Yeah. You know? And do you think you'll have a good chance of winning the thing? I uh, will think that the B team's coming through here quite strong, you know? So, uh, so I think we've got enough chance, eh? Uh. Who's your player to watch out for in the Player team? to watch out for. Big yeah. head champion there, Nats. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, the goalie, yeah. Yep, solid. Solid as a rock. Solid as a rock. He hasn't conceded a goal yet. So he yeah. hasn't. Yeah. Well, well, thanks, thanks very much. much. All right, All right cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Very tired looking Duke. Uh, how did you feel that game went for you? That was tough, it was tough. It was uh, quite a big pitch for four people. But I'm getting my second win back now. Yeah, it definitely showed in the pitch. It seemed that the younger ones just had an advantage on you. Well, I had a bit of an advantage, like, but you know, goals matter at the end of the day. I scored two and they scored none, so I think I've done alright. Yeah, uh, you got a goal for yourself. It wasn't one of your best goals, but uh, it still counted. Every goal's a goal. We yeah. poachers delight there. Uh, just gotta, you know, Dare to Duke. You know what I mean? Yeah, you had one fantastic run, but you just couldn't finish it off. What just was in your mind at that moment? Glory, all glory, and what my next celebration was going to be. Didn't know where I was going to do a cartwheel or a forward flip. Uh, I suggest the cartwheel next time, just for any other matches. But thank you for interviewing no us. No problem. And, uh, I'll see you in your next game. See you in the next game. With Bucketeers goalkeeper Stevie Herdman. Stevie, uh, glad to have you here today. Thanks very much, Connors. Pleasure to be here. Yes. Uh, it may say you were man of the match in your last game there for the Bucketeers. Uh, again, Connors, uh, thanks very much. For a man of 50, yeah. it's not too Yes, and how do you feel to respond to that allegation? You know, 50 year old playing a youthful team like the Bucketeers, and Mikey Wright, Mikey Wright, who had a great performance. Well, you know, maybe for the size of him, played really well. I have to say, apart from myself being the best player in the pitch, he was probably the second best player. Yeah, the second you know? best player. Yeah. a few good touches there for a man his size. Should have put it in the back of the net. He should have, but he, he, well, he didn't. You know? No, he didn't. Ultimately, he's he the, didn't. There's the rest of the tournament for that, you know, isn't there, Stevie? He can always catch up, Connor. How do you rate your chances in the tournament? I don't rate them at all. 
That's not good. To be quite honest with you, I'm playing for two teams. I think my second team is the better of the two teams. Who's your second team? I don't even know what to call them. That's unbelievable. Well, thanks very much, Stevie. Connor, it was a pleasure. Good luck. Thank you very much, Genesis. With Tracy's Angels shot stopper Connor Smeagol Shirk. Uh, well, after a performance like that, I can see why they call you Smeagol because you know the ball is your precious. But, yeah, it, it is. What do you have to say about your team's performance? I thought the Angels did very good today. Very, very, uh, what would you say? Efficient on the ball. Efficient, good yeah. passing, good speed. Well, and you say efficient, I thought you just could have finished a few more chances with Simon White up there, but you kept your team, you know, in the game with those two penalty saves. Crucial. Really, yeah. really saved your team. That's just what it breaks down to. Uh, do you think do you think now after saving those penalties you'll go on to win it? I reckon we've got a good chance of winning this nowadays. So. Yeah, yeah, well all the best, Connor, and thanks Thank very, you very much. much. Thanks. Joined here by the events organiser Ian Taggart. Ian, congratulations on a very smoothly ran event. Thanks very much. How do you feel it went for, for yourself, for your own point of view? Mm, a little bit fraud at the beginning. Um, weather wasn't too bad, uh, frankly. It stayed dry. Um, could have done with maybe a few more teams, a bit more help, but it's still a learning process. And do you think the Rangers were worthy winners in the end? Lucky winners, maybe. Lucky winners, yeah. yeah so a few, few good uh, youthful teams today, would you agree? Well, it's good to see that. Yeah. Good to see that. As one uh, football pundit said to me, where are all these young fellas when you want them on a Saturday <laughs> afternoon? And I said, well, they've got other things to do. Other well, things to do. Well, mm -hmm. good turnout tonight, from my opinion, and uh, let's hope next year's a great success as well. Thanks, Ian. Hopefully, yes, hopefully. Okay. Thanks, Thanks very much. Thank you.